Since the Afghanistan government collapsed to the Taliban, the U.S. has evacuated about 17,000 people. President Biden says 11,000 were evacuated just this weekend. Now, Democratic leaders here in Kentucky are pushing the state to offer a permanent home for Afghan refugees. Tom Lally heard from those lawmakers and is live now at Kentucky Refugee Ministries. Tom, what can you tell us? Yes, yeah, Shay, so since Kentucky legislature is no longer in session and won't be until next year, they're calling on federal lawmakers and Governor Bashir to open America and the state of Kentucky to these Afghan refugees. Today we heard from Catholic Charities. A spokesperson said they are ready to find home for these refugees. We also heard from uh, Haji Safiri from Afghanistan. He explained what recent days have been like as someone whose family hangs in this balance. I am every day connecting with those people in my family in Afghanistan, just only crying, nothing else. What should we do? What is our goal? We have a strong message we want to send. We are asking all of our federal officials and the governor to welcome Afghan refugees into Louisville and into Kentucky. The state lawmakers today also said that they have support from U.S. Representative John Yarmuth and that if nothing is done, their call to action doesn't turn into anything by January. They'll introduce, uh, once session opens back up in January, uh, they'll introduce a more concrete call to action to uh, their congressmen and other federal decision makers. Live for WHAS 11, I'm Tom Lally.